Hello everyone, this is Dale Cantrell with Marieville Holiness Church, wanting to bring you a Start Your Day Off Right series video for November the 1st. Uh, my quote is, every blessing ignored becomes a curse. My story is, we might liken it to letting go of a bell rope. If you've ever seen an old schoolhouse with a bell on top, an old church with a bell in the steeple, you will remember that to get the bell ringing, you've got to give it a big tug for a while. Once it began to ring, you just merely maintain the momentum. As long as you keep pulling, the bell keeps ringing. Forgiveness is letting go of the rope. It's not, it is just that simple, but if, when you do so, the bell keeps ringing. Momentum is still at work. However, if you keep your hands off the rope, the bell will begin to slowly and eventually stop. The unforgiving spirit will begin to slow and will eventually be still. Forgiveness is not something you feel, it's something you do. It's letting go of the bell rope. My scripture is Matthew six fourteen and 15, for if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will forgive you, but if you forgive not men their trespasses, neither will Father forgive your trespasses. My humor, I think it's somebody sent this to me, can't remember who it is right now, but thank you for it. Uh, it says, for the past 10 years, my wife has been complaining to me about not putting the cap back on the toothpaste. On our anniversary, I decided to change this bad habit and make my wife happy. For a week, I was diligently, always capping the toothpaste. I was expecting my wife to thank me, but she never did. Finally, last night, she turned and looked at me and says, why did you stop brushing your teeth? <laughs> well, anyway... This is Daryl Cantrell with Marie Valonis Church uh, saying I didn't come to replace your ministry or you get in the church just to try to supplement you if you need it. And if you have a quote, a story, a scripture, or a uh, or humor, a fling joke, my number is 256-508-4410. And until we do this next time, may God richly bless you.